sky, guys. It is another gray, foggy day, but soon to be 82 degree summer day on the last day of 2021. Hallelujah. It is Friday, December 31st, 2021. Uh, somehow, I have no idea how we made it. So since it is Friday, <clears throat> doing what I do every Friday, and that is to bring you my last ecological meltdown roundup round, rant of the year. Heading over to mongabay.com. But before I do that, since several of you have sent me this article, and it is nowhere mentioned, <clears throat> nowhere mentioned, uh, this story, anywhere in the mainstream media this morning, and it was uh, too late for press time for Rhett Butler. I'm just going to do a short, sweet, separate rant on this. Then we'll come back with the full fuselage. Fus fuselage. How do you pronounce that word? I've always loved that word, but I've never known how to pronounce it. F-U-S-S-I-L-A-D-E. I think is how you pronounce it. Anyway, but uh, this one pretty much... This short, sweet story, this is Common Dreams' version of, uh, of this story, <coughs> pretty much embodies everything I'm getting ready to say in my full-blown uh, ecological meltdown roundup rant. So if you don't want to go listen to that long one, pretty much this is a summation of it on the closing bell of 2021, heading in to the new year, uh, this is what, uh, according to the World Wildlife Fund anyway, this is what the World Wildlife Fund has to say about the state of the planet. Heading out of 2021, I love it, this is from, I guess, their The End Is Near desk. <laughs> Take it away, common dreams. <clears throat> Within a decade, planets natural. this would be our planets. <clears throat> Within a decade, our planet's natural world is facing its largest mass extinction event since the dinosaurs. The latest analysis by the World Wildlife Fund warns humanity possible victim of its own lifestyle might, might ultimately be added to the list of threatened species. We were added to the list of threatened species, I don't know, when we discovered fire. Uh, anyway, <clears throat> this is Julia Conley, Doomer Chick. Julia Conley wrapping up <clears throat> the... Uh, Wrapping up 2021, <clears throat> increasingly dire ecological damage and severe impacts of the climate crisis are pushing the natural world towards a mass extinction event unparalleled since the age of the dinosaurs. Conservationists in Germany warned this week with humanity itself possibly facing self-annihilation if behaviors do not change. <clears throat> Releasing its annual winners and losers list on Wednesday, the World Wildlife Fund German branch said 40,000 of the 142,500 species on the red list of threatened species by the International Union of Conservation of Nature, the IUCN, are now, quote, threatened with extinction. <clears throat> the red list is now longer than it has ever been since the IUCN began cataloging threatened species in 1964. More than 40% of amphibians 27% of shark and ray species, a third of reef building corals, and more than a quarter of all mammals on the red list 
are now threatened with extinction. At the current rate of species loss, quoting the World Wildlife Fund Germany, quote, around one million species could go extinct within the next decade, which would be the largest mass extinction event since the end of the dinosaur age, close quote. <clears throat> With planet heating atmospheric carbon dioxide emissions reaching a record high this year, contributing to drought, habitat loss, extreme weather and health problems in humans as well as other species, the organization noted that humans should view the extinction crisis as one that could, could affect us directly. <clears throat> this is the World Wildlife Fund Germany director Eberhard Brandes <coughs> quote, Species conservation is no longer just about defeating an environmental problem, but is rather about the question of whether or not humanity will eventually end up on the red list in an endangered category and thereby become a victim of its own lifestyle. If the earth is sick, so will the people be, because we depend on vital ecosystems and biodiversity for our safe and healthy life." Close quote. The losers on the list include the polar bear, which is already suffering from the erosion of its arctic habitat as the northern region becomes warmer. The Arctic Ocean could be completely free of ice by 2035. So they're calling for the mythical BOE by 2035 at the current late rate of loss, making it increasingly difficult for polar bears to find food. Sharks and rays also made the list the result of overfishing habitat loss and the climate crisis. All, a third of all of sharks and rays in the oceans were classified as threatened in 2021. African forest elephants have been considered, quote, critically endangered for the first time this year as their population in Central and West Africa has plummeted by 86% in the past 30 years. The inclusion of 40,000 species on the list of threatened species represents a major acceleration of biodiversity loss. In 2010, all right, 11 years ago, 17,300 species were considered to be under threat. So from 17,000 to 40,000 in 11 years. And then they actually try to find some hopium, talking about the winners on the list, but I am not going to insult your intelligence by acting like there are any winners uh, on the list of, uh, of endangered species, including Homo sapiens, which needs to be the first species on the list to go extinct so we don't keep growing the list. But anyway, now that I've rattled off that basically encapsulation of my full-fledged Manga Bay rant. We're going to wrap this up and uh, for the last time check in with Rhett Butler and the boys and girls at Manga Bay for their 2021 roundup coming right up. Bye guys.